Bill Durkin combines inspiration and education with every event. So one of the things that, that we want to do is kind of raise our awareness because there's all kinds of people in your lives that you have the opportunity to be that positive influence in. And you know they say that everybody makes somebody happy. Some people when they enter a room and other people when they leave a room. And it's like we want to be thank God this person showed up. And if you thought about the people in your life that were that negative influence, and you asked yourself the question, you think they were totally aware of the effect their behavior was having on you? Chances are they weren't. You know, granted, there may be some people that wake up in the morning and say, gee, how can I make people's lives miserable today? But most people, when they get up, they want to do well. They're just not aware. We call it sensory acuity, the ability to pick up the effect your behavior is having on someone else. And what we want to do as leaders is really make a commitment to take whatever level we're at right now and bringing out the best in people and take it to the next level. So in the time that we have remaining, we want to really get together with, uh, with each other here and, and go through a couple of different exercises where you get a chance to share some ideas, but also practice some of the skills that we believe are critical for getting you up to this uh, third level of fresh ideas, to really have your competitive advantage be your people. Michael Eisner from Disney says, our inventory is people and they go home every night. We have to take care of them. They're not in the business of theme parks or Mickey Mouse or Disneyland. What they're really in the business is of people because he said people are the ones that create our new ideas. Walt Disney actually was the first to actually say when somebody said, aren't you afraid of people stealing your ideas? And he says, no, because we have people that can create faster than they can steal. By the time they're stealing our old stuff, we're on to some new stuff. And the value of that is you attract great people. Everybody wanted to work for Walt Disney when he was starting out because it was such a great environment, because it was creative. They could use their, their God-given talents in an extraordinary way. So the companies that figure out fresh ways to get into the market, creative ways to increase their revenue, decrease their costs, and add value at the same time are the ones that are going to really attract and keep good people. So we just want to share a few simple, but I think very profound ideas today that I think are going to help you get from where you're at to where you want to be. In fact, all leaders, I encourage you to think of yourself as coaches. The word coach literally comes from uh, 16th century England that means taking a valuable person from where they're at to where they want to be. 